Hey, this is Mark the Meerkat Suffering here at FreeOnlineTradingEducation.com. Well, look at this. Getting to be late fall here. The sun's getting low in the sky. We have our equinox coming up on Sunday for the fall. Hey, before we show you a trade, uh, just want to remind you that we do have a three-day 301 mentoring program going on. It's three-day immersion. That's September 28th through 30th. If you're interested in more information regarding that, just contact Carolina at grocktrade.com. All righty. Let's take a look at a trade that we had in a grok star room this morning on HIMX. Now, this is what it looked like in pre-market. This is all pre-market information, and this line right here, that is where the opening bell was to occur. And these lines are actually from my trading platform and lines I was drawing during the pre-market times. Now, uh, what we have here is pulled up here to a high, a new high, and then it pulled back to a line of support. And it's beginning to set up what we call a pullback buy or a bull pullback. If you want to know more about that, go to our site, freeonlinetradingeducation.com, to the free chart school. And there it is, pullback buy. Here's a de verbal description of it, or a written description of it, I should say. And then here it is. It goes up, and then it pulls back to a line of support. And if this continues to roll up, it is very bullish. So that's what we have here. It pulled up here. It pulled back to the 50 and the 20 moving average. All right, let's see what happened after opening. Boom, boom, there it goes. And I had an order set up here, and I got filled at $9.50. I am long, H-I-M-X. But as you can see, it pulled down here hard, but it came to the 8 EMA. That could be, this is, by the way, a one-minute uh, chart. That could be a line of support. And... Bam, there it goes. I had my stop just under that 8 EMA, and it dropped, and by the time I got filled, it was at 940. So that's uh, minus 1.0% in three minutes. Well, I showed you this because sometimes these patterns work out, and sometimes they don't. We had a pattern very similar to this turnout uh, for 9.4% on one trade on ATOS this morning, and we had a very nice day in the Grokstar room. I'm going to be uh, on the road for the next couple of days, so my next new video will be on Tuesday, September 24th. So until then, just remember that anything can happen. We have to make sure of that, especially with the Fed announcement this afternoon. I'm recording this just 10 minutes before the Fed announcement. Uh, I personally would never trade during the Fed announcement because you never know what's going to happen. Trade well. 